if Barclay band that a single pen is the one in picking. <laughs> Seriously, all the pen has been taken. Because people will just come in, need a pen. Back to school. <laughs> <laughs> it's phenomenal. London is an amazing place. When you get on the tube in London and your driver is English, you know, you hear things like in the most customer friendly voice. This is Victoria Line Station to Water to Central. Trains are going to support. Mind the gap, please. Please, mind the gap. In the most, they are begging you for your safety. Mind the gap, please. Please, mind the gap. Let a Nigerian man be your driver and get on the tube. The problem with Nigerians is we are aggressive for no reason. I think we are the only one paying tax. This is Victoria Line Station to Water to Central. Mind the gap. The driver will feel sick, he will open the door. Mind the guy, mind the guy, you know mind the guy. Are you dead? <laughs> if you don't mind the guy, if you don't spot that and die, oh. if you die, nobody will tell your mother. Oh, oh is he born or no? no. <laughs> Bigger, it's just, you know. <laughs> because, you know, when you give birth, to a new baby boy. Normally people will come and see you, especially maybe no, um, you have to stay a couple of days in the hospital with the baby. You know, people will come and see you. Well done. <laughs> people will come and see you to greet the baby. And uh, Now, if English folks come to see you, I think they tend to take things beyond the normal. They look at your baby. The baby newly born. You know in Africa, we can't name a child until after certain days. They start asking you for the name. What's his name? Like I'm like, we have a culture. The <laughs> they, they even want the placenta to have the name. What's the name of the placenta? <laughs> That's why English folks come to see you. Now when Asian folks come to see you, they seem to be discussing some lives. We know your concern. Come see our friend Mohammed came to see us with our baby. Saw the baby. Saw the baby. Sir? Oh, Mark. But you did not tell us you are going to be having a baby. But you saw my wife's belly. Oh. Oh, so when are you going to be having another one? We have 24 hours stable. We are still yet to recover from this one. But when your raffles come to see you, it's fantastic. Because they are aggressive. They walk straight to the baby. It's only a baby. Don't be old star. They just stole the chick. Oh, that care. Oh, that body, yeah, yeah. Be a body, bye And the old baby. Oh, my lanty, lanty. <laughs> you know, recently I was saying that uh, David Cameron is not flying African Airways at all. He's always going on British Airways. I keep wondering why. It's always going, all his troops, all his stuff abroad is always taking British Airways for once. Let him fly African Airways. Oh, okay, Nigerian Airways is not available anymore. But let him look for Africa. No, it doesn't do that. Why? <laughs> why? Because when you get on, I was flying um, between states in Nigeria, and you know normally when you get on the on the plane, they tell you safety check, life jacket, blah blah blah, all those things they do. They check for once. I just said, let me confirm what this girl is saying. Whether there's a life jacket or that one. <laughs> Brothers and sisters in Christ, <laughs> your life is secure in Christ. <laughs> flying one day was a Nigerian plane. I don't want to mention names. It was during the crisis of plane crash left, right and center. You know, it was flying at them. Suddenly, the pilot just announced that this is the voice of the pilot from the cockpit. Um, 
have obviously lost control and contact with the control tower. So we absolutely do not know where we're heading for. So I employ those that have God to begin to pray to their God. And if you do not have God, you might need to borrow one. That's the pilot. See the way people were borrowing God. God borrow me your God. People were praying. There was an affair there as well. We're just praying. It's the line. Doing all the prelims. And then he forced God. Bismillah. Bismillah. Scary. Bismillah. 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 And the point it was getting was the blood. <laughs> the pastor asked him, which blood? He consigned you. But I'm blood of Ram, or blood of Jesus. All the blood. blood. Blood is blood. <laughs> True is in Christ. I mean, you, whether you got not or south, is in Christ. I and mean, when that fasting is starting, and um, a lot of the uh, after fasting, they will go to they will travel to Saudi. I've got a lot of uh, Muslim friends as well who will travel. And I say this joke in their presence, and they all laugh. So I'm going to tell you, they all laugh and all that. You know, I come from, I grew up in a part of Korea State called Ilori. How many of you know Ilori very well? Very good. Now, during the Mecca time, they go for the Hajj. Okay. They go for the Hajj, right? So now, and they go in batches. They travel in batches. The plane will come, pack about 200 people, and then, and they usually, those that are traveling, they call them pilgrims. Um, what do you call them again? Pilgrims. Very good. They will gather and then they will go in batches. So, this particular batch of people were being delayed. They couldn't get, they couldn't travel. Now their coordinator will come. And you know what we'll say, before they say anything, they'll say, Salah, 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 And then they watch chant, Salah, Salah, Salah. We are sorry, our plane cannot move again today. Isha Allah, tomorrow we will move. It will come again after tomorrow. Salah, 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 They will say, Salah, Salah, Salah. We are sorry, our plane cannot move today. Isha Allah, tomorrow we will move. And people have paid for this flight. After two weeks, the coordinator keeps coming to tell them, Salah, 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 We are sorry, when it came after two weeks, people were tired, the Lord man was vexed. They have been waiting for him to come. You have to wallow me. You have to wallow me. They have food to read, don't go. When the coordinator come, as usual, Salah Allah no be your Kareem, he was expecting them to respond for where nobody answered. You see, when an Elohim is angry, you can see it all over him, his body will be shaking. Salah Allah no be your Kareem, nobody answered. Salah Allah no be your Kareem, one man just stood up, Salah Allah was that. Salah Allah was that. Asa, was that color, was that the color, or what is it was that? Your band, are they eating? Now, I need the band, sir. It's not the only one I will play. Please get the band. Let them stop their meal. Stop the late one, they're not too. Ah, all right, you see what's up? What's up, all right? What's up, all right? He doesn't know what we are talking about. Well done, guys. Well done. Welcome back. How many bottles do you take? She has gotten his wife. All we are doing is he just want us to run up quickly and go home. Let the only one start. If there's any day in his life that he doesn't want Jesus to come, it's today. In fact, if you look at all the instruments, there is no trumpet there. You know what? 
Francis in Oklo trumpet, now he's a lawyer. You see, she will begin to beg God now. 